Continue our team coverage now with the latest on long lines that many voters had to face across the country and right here in Texas. Channel 2's Vincent Corelli live with the latest on that. Good morning, Vince. Sion, good morning. Some voters were forced to wait hours to cast their ballot, many frustrated. And this morning, Mayor Turner spoke out. Super Tuesday stretched into Wednesday morning with lines around the block at TSU and other voting centers. This man says he waited six hours and 20 minutes to vote. I want to get my vote in to voice my opinion. And I won't gonna let none stop me. Mayor Sylvester Turner venting his frustration this morning. I want to thank the voters uh, who endured the long lines, and they were long lines, and waited hours to vote at Texas Southern. I think they were voting at 1 a.m. Election officials say a big problem was the distribution of voting machines between political parties at voting centers. So we started out equal. Now, as the day went on and we saw that the Democratic turnout was much larger, we were constantly bringing in more equipment to several locations. The TSU Voting Center had eight voting machines, but the turnout was so high, election workers brought 14 more. It was long. It was real long. A lot of people walked away. The issue, some centers weren't expecting so many voters under the new countywide polling place program. And another problem, a software glitch at midnight temporarily shut down voting machines. So this is just a reminder that come November, you know, I think it's important to have plenty of voting machines that are working. Um, around the entire county. Now, despite the long lines, most voters at TSU stayed positive, saying they were happy to exercise their right to vote. Reporting live downtown, Vincent Crivelli, KPRC, Channel 2 News.